Welcome back, everybody, to another fantastic and beautiful day here in the valley. It's always so much fun to be in the valley. Um, what do we got for the day? Well, we got a birthday today. We got, uh, what's his name's birthday? Vincent, that's the name. I was drawing a blank for a second there. Uh, but yeah, we got Vincent's birthday here today, which is great. Obviously, we're still on the hunt for the elusive last few leaks and then we got to go bug hunting a little bit later on so i think these uh these this video is gonna be a little bit more um go go if you know what i mean so uh bear with me as we go go our way through this video and away we go hop in let's go see kent How's it going? Uh, have a cheese. Perfect. Uh, but more importantly, have a war memento. Let's go. We fought together. Oh, beautiful. Excellent. It means a lot to me. Here, take this. It's been sitting in the back of our cupboard. Beautiful. Some gourmet tomato salt. Can't go wrong with that. I assume Vincent's over at the library. Indeed, he is. So, uh, oh, I uh, see some moss. Oop. Thank you. I will take that. Uh, and let's pop on over. I want to get this quest complete as well. Um, I'm still looking continually for the leaks while we're going here, but uh, not too much luck so far. All right, my friend, have a snail on your birthday you can open it beautiful 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 awesome um that's it that's all that's all we're doing here nothing else time to go deliver the gourmet tomato salt let's get that done oh baby there you go gus hopefully you can use something special there uh that would be fantastic and while i'm here have yourself a nice slice of cheese because why not? That's what we do around here. We run around and we do stuff. Well, not a single leak to be found throughout all of that, which is kind of terrible. Um, but in the meantime, oops, I forgot my bombs. Let's go buy at least a couple from Mr. Dwarf here. Does the dwarf like cheese? <laughs> Everybody likes cheese. The dwarf likes cheese too. Excellent. How does that remind you of home? You guys were big, uh, big cheese, uh, big cheese, uh, people, you know, just saying. All right. Uh, um, let's go with, let's grab at least a couple just regular bombs, I guess. And, uh, yeah, we're gonna, we gotta get what a hundred bug meat, uh, before too long here. So I think you just kind of rinse and repeat down low here. Not a big deal. There's some right there, right off the hop. I love it. Um, nothing too exciting, uh, for you all anyways, uh, in terms of content on this front, but, uh, yeah, we'll, uh, we'll get this done as quick as we possibly can, um, here, but yeah, I'm not going to bore you with it either. So, you know, boom, boom, pop some stone. I'll take it, take some resources. Can't go wrong. All right, final countdown of bug meat. Let's go. And apparently, what is this? A secret note? Um, sap. I do not require. Uh, as you can see, uh, I did want to push this. Uh, there's no better helper than a raisin-fed Junimo. Interesting. All right. Um, it is 1.10 a.m., so we are going to farm totem it out of here. I probably could have made it back just fine, but you know what? Let's not risk it. This will also give us time to put away some items here. Oh, no. Oh, I just wasted the fairy dust. Well, rip. <laughs> rip All right. Well, it is what it is. So, yeah. Yeah, fairy dust. I forgot. It uh, auto cooks. Uh, it automatically enables machines. Yeah. So that was the thing. That was the thing. All right. Well, on that note, let's hit the hay uh, and call it another beautiful day. I don't remember if I sold stuff or what, but we got enough to go see Willie. Oh, I did sell quite a bit of stuff. Awesome. Another 16 grand. I will gladly be taking that home 
to the bank. Um, obviously, I think we completed enough of that quest. We can go see Willie, which is great. Uh, the bookseller's in town. All right. Sounds like a plan. Let's uh, drink up the coffee in the morning. And let's, uh, of course, say hi to our beautiful penny wife. Who's maxed out? You know, little details. Uh, we got mail. Uh, vegetable medley from Caroline. I did a little bit of gift giving. Indeed. Pepper poppers from Shane. Can't go wrong with a little pepper popper. Pepper popper pe picked up a pepper popper pet pot. Pet to pet to, you know what I mean? Yeah, you know what I mean. There we go. This is one of the big advantages to that scythe. I can actually harvest all of these guys. Doesn't matter if I have access to them or not. That is beautiful. But in the meantime, let's hop on Appa here and head on up. Deposit a few items. Uh, the green beans. The bullhead frenzy has begun in the mountains as well. Alrighty then. All righty then. You know what? I'm going to uh, kind of look through here. Like the, the common stuff, I can sell, right? We don't need we don't need the common stuff if we have some of the higher up stuff, right? So we'll, uh, we'll get rid of some of these. I don't think we've shipped the green bean yet, so that's fun. That can go as well. Um, do we need green beans otherwise? Nah, nah, we're fine. We're fine. All right. These blue jazz, I am going to put into our seed maker, I believe. Yeah, let's throw them in there. We'll keep that train going, get ourselves a little bit more of the blue jazz. It looks like I got a few more down there as well. And I might as well replant. You know, what, what am I, who am I kidding, right? We're, we're replanting as we go. All right, so I might as well grab all these guys. Oh man, that is beautiful. That feels so good. Doesn't that feel good? I swear that feels pretty darn good. All right. There we go. There we go. Excellent. Uh, looks like our garlic is also ready. So let's grab that guy. Ooh, that feels so good. I love it. I love it. Uh, and we'll replace with some blue jazz. All right. Very good. Very good. Um, I'm going to go around. I'm going to complete all the stuff. Uh, the basics, anyways, on the farm here and get everything rocking and rolling like saying hi to all my beautiful little animals. What are you doing all the way up there, goat? So the majority of the stuff around the farm has somewhat been handled, uh, to say the least. Uh, let's just see what you are. A uh, book, you don't say. You don't say, and beautiful. We got ourselves another leak, that's great. And we got some more worms here right on the edge. Oh, of course, clay. The thing I don't need. All right, we're going to pop on down to El Rabino's uh, down here because, well, a couple things. I can give Robin a gift, which is always wonderful. Uh, you know, it's a thing. But more importantly, I can construct a new farm building. And what are we going to go with today? We are going to go with the Deluxe Barn upgrade. Yes, indeed. That is exactly what we are doing. I want some pigs. Simple as that. So we are going to get that rocking and rolling. Demetrius, I am not maxed with you. Hopefully, this will get us there, my friend. Uh, it should. Are we there? We're there. Beautiful. Um, I don't think Maru's at home, so we're just going to leave that for right now. In the meantime, I am going to do a quick little search of... Linus, we're good. Yeah, yeah, we're good. Uh, search of the leaks, you know, the, the wonderful leaks. I'm sure you guys are sick and tired of hearing about the god dang leaks. Uh, but it's a necessity when you have these kind of search and rescue missions. Uh, yeah, it's not looking overly promising. Um, in that, on that note, hi, Caroline, I have another gift. Beautiful. I'll talk with you as well, just because you're here. Just because you're here. All right, we got the bug meat to go turn in. Let's go and do just that. Um, I think that's a great idea. While we search around for some leaks, of course. Um, but yeah, not too, too bad. It's, it's a thing. It's a thing. All right. We're going to head on down. We'll turn it, that into Willie, who I probably should have double checked. Yeah, he's down there. Figured, but you know, it's a thing. He can wander off. 
He can. He's more than welcome to. All right, let's pop into Willie's shop here. Oops. Actually, the bin is outside. For the meat. For the bug meat. There we go. Three grand. Don't mind if I do, Willie. Don't mind if I do. Speaking of Willie, let's... Uh, I don't think we're maxed with Willie yet. Not quite. That should do it. Are we maxed out? Very, very full now, I believe. We should be. Yeah, there we go. Beautiful. Maxed out with Willie. We are getting there, folks. We are getting there. Um, I did notice, while we're here, he wanted an eel. Now, hold up. Hold up. An eel, I don't think I've fished. I have not. We do not have the current time of the day or the rain, so I probably shouldn't have accepted that quest. But it's okay. You know what? It is what it is. Oh, it's Robin's Art Festival. Very nice. Always fun to have the art festival going on. Go for it. You do you. Get it done. She's very eclectic, hey? Got some very unique art, to say the least. Thanks for coming to my art show. Yay! As some of you know, I came to this town because I wanted to draw inspiration from the beautiful surroundings. I don't know what these guys are. <laughs> All right, sculptures. Let's go. I haven't named this. Uh, yeah, very good. All right, very interpretive art. That's good. This one's called Post Dimensional Null Space. Yeah, that sounds about right. <laughs> Very good. I've been calling this one Eggheads. Yeah. Well, that's very cool, Leah. Very artistic. And the last one is called Wood Sculpture 3. The fi Celebration of Wood. Well, those are my sculptures. Oh, one last thing. I'd like to say thanks to my special friend, Krillik. He gave me the idea for the show and courage to go through with it. But it's true. Sounds cheesy, but it's true. I'm proud. Events like this really bleed life into the town. Love your art. Yeah, that makes sense, Demetrius. The great use of wood. Robin would like that. Yeah. Penny, good job. Thanks, everyone. Did you sell stuff? I hope you sold stuff, you know. Now let's start the bidding. There we go. Five grand for the pink one. Yeah, there you go, Lewis. Perfect. Ah, I love it. Good old little art show. Can't go wrong with that. All right, I'm going to uh, pop on up. We get ourselves a bounty ticket. Are we maxed with Sam? Yeah, we are. No concerns there. Let's pop into Lewis's and... I don't even remember. It's been a while. We get, is that pig art? I think it's a pig painting. Nice. Very good, very good. All right, I will gladly take it. Why not? <laughs> I say, why not? All right, I do want to also jump on down to go see Krobus, even though it's a Thursday. Um, I will come back again tomorrow. Uh, let's put those down there. I want to gift him a uh, little something. And I also want to get the item that we need for the um, Passage to the Witch. Can't really think of a better place for the pig painting. Uh, I would like to put it in the barn. I think I might need a mod for that, though. I don't recall. Um, let me know if you guys know down in the comments, because that would be awesome if I could place the pig painting with our pigs, if you know what I mean. So, yeah, just one of those little details to uh, to think about and explore. Um, I should probably make some more coffee as well. It looks like we got some more mead, which is not a bad thing. Looks like we're still churning through some... Oh, we finally got through all the hops. Okay, that's cool. It took us almost a year, so that's fun. Uh, I do want to make a quick little... Uh, oh, wait, hold on. Uh, no, you can't be there. Thank you very much. Uh, I do want to make a little bit of the triple espresso. And what do we have here? Hi, Penny. Welcome home. It was good. It was fantastic. Uh, that's great. I'm glad you enjoy your work so much. I'm happy you're home. Yeah? 
Oh, you smell like the outdoors. It's nice. Oh, boy. Well, you know, I really appreciate the hard work you do for the family. So it's important to me that when you come home, the house is nice and cozy and everything's in order. Oh, I appreciate that. I was thinking I'd like to redecorate the bedroom with some of my own handmade decor. But first, I have to ask you, what style do you prefer? Oh, boy. That is a great question. Um, I actually don't know. Uh, what do I prefer overall? Uh, forest and moon, beautiful blue, strawberry home pirate theme. Uh, probably forest and moon. I'm a little bit more of that natural uh, something soothing. Yeah. Okay. I won't touch any of your chests, but it would be nice if you could move them out of the bedroom. So just the one chest? Oh, the popovers are ready. All right. You say so. Yum. Yum. Plus eight energy. Excellent. Just what I needed. All right. Eight energy. Beautiful. Uh, I don't know if I need... To, I should probably move um, the one thing, right? I probably should. All right. Let's put the coffee, spare coffee in there. Do we move this guy? Probably. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Let's move the Joja and that. We'll actually place it in the kitchen where it probably should have gone in the first place. But yeah, we might as well. Uh, yeah, a couple couple free Jojas there. No big deal. All right. Very cool. Um, other than that, we have this. That's in the desert. I have. To, oh, we didn't go to the bookseller. Bet you that's over. Rip. Well, I didn't even think about it. There's only so much time in the day, folks. Only so much time. Uh, let's pop in here. I don't know if I looked in here for the leak yet either. I see that we have daffodil and some moss, which I'll take that every day. All day. All right. Well, um, yeah, I'm guessing the bookseller's gone. I'm going to run over just in case, but I'm pretty sure that they leave already. Uh, it's already pretty late in the evening. Uh, obviously, we're not uh, we're not in the process of getting that eel because it's not raining, uh, so that's not going to happen. Oh, it's still there. Hi. Uh, let's see. What do you got? We got the skill books. Yeah. Way of the wind. Okay. Good. Way of the wind part two. You run a little bit faster. That would take all of my money though. I think we're just gonna leave that as is for right now. Yeah. I mean, as much as I'd like to spend my dough, I think that the bookseller's a little bit more like we do it later. You know what I mean? I'm just just throwing that out there as an idea. So, yeah, we might we might have to come back uh, to the bookseller in the future and see about uh, some of those more expensive books once we have a little bit more spare available money, to say the least. Okay, a quick uh, mail machine. Uh, just to bolster our ranks here, I should be getting a void mayonnaise, which will assist us, obviously, uh, with the uh, goblin and witch hole scenario. Um, but I'm also getting prepared for potential of pigs. So other than uh, closing up the doors here, let me also make a couple of oil makers and throw them down here as well so that we're just ready to roll uh, with the plans of getting, obviously, you know, some pigs right out of the gate. That's also why I need to save all my money. Um, I don't really have... We're just going to get rid of that. I don't really have the ability to, uh, you know, kind of sort of just maximize that right now. So we're just going to... We're just going to do what we can do, right? We're going to get what we can get. We're going to sell what we could sell. Uh, we are getting a pretty good amount of bees, which is nice. Um, a lot of honey. I should probably get a few more beehives. Actually, I might be able to do that right now. I can't remember what they take. Uh, like the bee houses. What do those guys take? Iron maple syrup. That's the one. Yeah, I got I got some. I got some, I got some syrup. I got some syrup. I got some iron. I think 
I think that we can uh, we can pull this off. Let's grab out that and that. Is that what we needed? Oh no, it's coal, not stone, you silly. Why would you need stone in a bee house? I don't know why you need coal either, but you know, that's a thing. <laughs> that's a thing. It looks like we're actually running low on wood uh, here. We're pretty much out. So we're gonna have to definitely get a little bit of a wood farm uh, wood farming going here because yeah, that's not ideal uh, in the slightest. So definitely need to get that up and running uh, before too long. There we go. A couple more bee houses ready to go and produce us even more honey and the likes so um other than that nice little bedtime at 1 a.m what else is new right we are gamers after all all right look at that we sold some fairy roses some mead some mayo we sold a little bit of garlic and some of the blue jazz as well beautiful that's a nice big old return to say the least which is fantastic all right excellent excellent spreading wheeze cause damage to your farm what where i'm annoyed i'm very very annoyed what are you talking about where where is this damage to my farm thanks again for coming out to my show uh egg festival tomorrow very nice lewis very very good uh where was this damage to my farm though i do not know all of that should be fine that's all fine that should be fine yeah that's all good that should be fine 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 is it oh right here those little sneaky devils did they break my path I think they broke my path. All right. Anyways, um, you know, it happens. It happens. I'm not going to sweat it. All right. I'm going to uh, get to work around here because, well, we can get to work, Robin. I see you over there. I always forget. Can you, like, just give her a gift right here now? Yeah, you can. Get to work. <laughs> All right. Beauty. I love it. That's actually a really... Uh, good way to get like some hearts with robin you know for the week if you kind of plan it right you can give her like four gifts and be like uh thank you very much you know so yeah anyways i'm going to uh get some things done because that's what we do around here and uh yeah what's next on the agenda 60 grand in our pocket feels pretty good working on the barn feels pretty good um yeah i don't know I gotta figure that one out, I guess. More leaks. We need more leaks. There we go. That's the game plan. Leaks. Uh, also, we can take our void mayo, which is very good. And that will get us our opportunity to um, get past the witch. So we can do that today. We are also a Friday. Oh my. What is that? We got. Is that a baby raccoon? Is that a baby raccoon up there? Look at him, sticking it in. <laughs> so cute. All right, a couple of things that we need to definitely get to are pretty straightforward. Um, some of them are not as straightforward as others. Uh, so one, we definitely need to get ourselves some more hardwood farming going. I am out after making those uh, oil makers. So definitely need to get this guy up and running uh, a little bit more frequently than what we have been. That's for sure. Uh, basically, I have to do it at least once in a while. All right. So I'm going to get this all done um, and do this more frequently, which will be quite helpful overall. And obviously the leaks are we need to go find some more of them still. So still another thing to kind of work on let's have a quick little chat with our good friend Krobus and of course get ourselves that iridium sprinkler which is the main reason we came by not that we don't like Krobus it's just you know it's a thing 
it's a thing, right? All right, uh, very good. I didn't find much for leaks, uh, to say the least, in the forageable department, but we still have a little bit to explore. Um, one of the things that we need to do is we do need to get out to the desert at some point here. I am debating just going right now uh, to turn in the Valley Rose. And then we can come back and do the other things. It seems like a bit of a waste of money, but you know what? I think we got to do it. I think we've got to just go and uh, we'll come back, right? I don't think it's a big deal. I think it's just one of those things. Got to get it done uh, at ASAP. So uh, without further ado, let's pop on down to uh, go see our wonderful friend, Sandy. Very good, very good. And let's say hi. How's it going? Um, I assume you also like cheese, right? I probably have like nothing with Sandy. Yeah, almost nothing. Yeah, that's what I figured. There you go. Have a cheese. All right. Uh, well, unless you're a cactus farmer, maybe I am. I am actually. A Stardew Valley Rose. Oh, yeah. There you go. And... And we got ourselves the remote control. Can't go wrong with that. While I'm out here, I'm debating. Um, do I pick up? I mean, I can just grab a honey. How many honeys can you buy? Can't you just like make this into mead and sell it for more? I think so. That's kind of cool. Um, should I buy some star fruit? Probably should, right? I mean, we have some still. Let's just leave it. I don't want to waste all my money out here. I want to keep it pretty straightforward. We're going to head on right back, basically. If that's it, that's all for us. I mean, I might as well grab uh, some of this stuff while I'm out here. But yeah, we're not doing much otherwise. Uh, panning spot. Take some panned goods. Uh, a bomber jacket. A what? That sounds fun. All right. Cool. Let's get out of here and back to town. Uh, we have the advanced remote. That is, I think, the final step to that quest, uh, if I recall. So it should be pretty easy for us to do that. We just have to pop down and go see George, uh, which shouldn't be too much of a hassle whatsoever. All right. First things first, though, let's do a quick drop of some items. That at least clears up most of the inventory there. Um, yeah, I'm just going to add that to the queue. Might as well. All right, we'll pop up here. We'll take a look for some more uh, potential of leaks. It doesn't look like we're going to get all that lucky here today on the leak front. But, uh, you know, a couple other little details, to say the least. Any, any, any. Nope, does not look like it. I did not know that that button dismounted you. Is it X? X dismounts you? So does C. Ah, interesting. Anyways, uh, let's pop on up. We have ourselves some void mayonnaise. Uh, that should be what we require to get by Mr. Goblin here and progress on this quest line. So, boom. There you go. That smell. I can't resist. Give me that. No problem, my friend. No problem. All right. We got the magic ink. Very good stuff. Uh, that's nice. We can get that done. Dark Shrine of Selfishness. Dark Shrine of Memory. And Dark Shrine of Night Terrors. Uh, allowing monsters to appear on your farm at night. No, not yet. Not yet. Not yet is the keyword. Can this actually teleport me? I can't ever remember. Yeah, I can. I always forget about that. That takes me right into the wizard's basement, which we can get the ink. Very nice indeed. Er, did you happen to see my ex-wife? Well, what about the house? You think she lives alone or? Oh God. Come on, man. Come on. <laughs> actually, don't tell me. I don't want to know. All right. Sounds good. <laughs> I won't tell you. Anyway, you must be wondering about your reward. Here. Wizard book. Wizard catalog. Let's go. Let's go. This is a big one for sure. Uh, this is... 
pretty darn nice, to say the least. Magic buildings and things like that, like Junimos, which would be phenomenal. Not gonna lie. Actually, all things considered, I'm pretty sure I could already buy some Junimos if I wanted to. Um, let's just, uh, hi, have a cheese while you're at it. There we go. So, yeah, Junimos, stone, nine star fruit, and fiber. Yeah, easily done. Easily done. Hmm, that gets me thinking. Do we just rush some Junimos? That might be a good idea, actually. All right, we are back over here. I don't have my horse because it's all the way up by the witch. I don't remember if I could teleport back, but uh, I'm going to finish clearing out a little bit of this farmland over here, and then we're going to get back in and place down uh, some of our iridium sprinklers and the likes of that. But as you remember, I also needed some wood. Another thing I was just looking at, let's go sell a few of our beautiful little flowers here. I mean, why are we keeping so many? I don't know. Um, I think we can even get rid of some of the crocus uh, around here and probably all these crystal fruit while we're at it. Uh, we should be getting a lot better quality moving forward on all, almost all of this, but this should actually be a decent chunk of change for us as our flower farming selves. So I'm very happy about that. Um, other than that, we are looking pretty good. We got a few things probably popping up tomorrow. Um, we got one more day uh, left on Robin. I don't remember if I checked. Nothing posted yet. Not surprised by that. Our skills, eh, we're about halfway there to our next one. Not too, not too shabby. Marnie's close. Robin's getting up there. Um, yeah, a lot of gift giving this week, which is good. I've I've hit most people, which is nice to see. We do have the TV remote to hand over to George in the morning. Uh, but I think for right now, let's just head on to bed and uh, call it a night here in the valley. Uh, should be, like I said, a decent amount of dough, to say the least. Yeah, not too shabby in terms of all of those goods. Um, the mayo is still a huge chunk of that though, hey? Those crocus, not too bad. And crystal fruit, I'll take it. I'll take it very nicely. All right. Um, other than that, uh, on to day 13 of spring already. Time flies when you're having fun. Um, but yeah, anyways, uh, back to action. Oh, it looks like Penny got up and did some watering today. Or not. I don't know where she's at today. Hey, a potato thank you okay another beautiful day i went and cleared out the quarry and a couple of other things just to end it off and it was the egg festival so i was kind of avoiding that i couldn't get much else done to be blunt so we sold some flowers we got some things going another you know, almost 10 grand in the bank account. And that's going to do it for us on this episode up to day 14. As we got the new room decorated by Penny. That's very nice. Very nice indeed. Thank you. Very nice. It's beautiful. It's beautiful, darling. That's very blue, though. It's very blue. <laughs> Cust I quilted this custom bedspread by hand. Wow. That's impressive. What do you think? Looks great. I love it. I love it. Looks amazing. That's more decorating than I normally do. So there you go. Yeah, it's looking great, Penny. Keep it up. Uh, you want to do the... You want to decorate the rest of the house to match now? Yeah? Maybe? 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 No? No? Uh, Penny's been working very hard around the house. It really feels like home. Those are nice little additions. I don't think those were additions before, uh, but I don't know that for sure. So, but anyways, that's going to be it for us today together. Anyways, we got some rain outside. Actually, I think it's a thunderstorm. If I recall, indeed, it appears to be. So uh, we got lots to get done uh, moving forward here. We are one leak away. We still have lots of time, 15 more days, uh, to say the least. But, uh, yeah, time is starting to tick here. So, anyways, that's going to be it. That's going to be all. Have a good one. Bye-bye.